Dan will be leading first. Dan's been having really good qualifying all day, good practice. Jordan swings it wide there, takes out a couple cones. Look at Dan, his angle. Keeping it really wide so he can keep the speed up. Dan O'Claro coming in to finish this one with the final turn. And Jordan, nice job as well. Once again, after these guys, Danny and Abner, get ready. Jordan will lead this one, Dan will follow. It's a good jump on it. Dan waiting so he can kind of have a lot of open track in front of him. He goes a little bit uh, higher speed through these drifts. As you can see, he starts his early. Jordan uh, throws the angle on that one. Dan keeping it nice and smooth through that far section. Jordan, good job. He's a little bit inside right there. Has to cut the wheel, lost his drift. Dan keeping it away on the outside. Nicely done. Perfectly set up this interior section coming into the last corner. Advancing to the next round is Dan. All right, as we have Abner and Danny lined up, Danny will be leading the first round and Abner will be following. Next run, Don and Andrew. Don and Andrew, and then our final matchup, Carl and Curtis. run by both of those fellows, Abner and Danny. They're going to switch it up, change orders. Advancing to the next round, give it up for Abner. Next up, Don Kabuhat and Andrew. And the last matchup is Carl versus Curtis. So guys, make your way to the start line, please. All right, Don leads off first. Don, a little bit inside there, out off the track. All right, Don picked up a cone there. We're going to fish that out of his wheel well. Andrew will be leading this one. <laughs> Getting a cone out of his. All right, there we go. Got the cone. Andrew leading. Don follows. Andrew's got 
nothing but open track in front of him. Don, that's where he went off last time, trying to not do that again. Andrew taking a really wide line. Don right in the center of the track. Andrew using all of the track this run. Takes a wide outside line there. Don coming in the inside. Looking for the pass. Didn't quite get it. All right, up next we got Carl going up against Curtis. And they are off the last matchup of the round of 16. And in that last one, advancing to the next round, give it up for Andrew. As we see Carl and Curtis here. Nice run by Curtis right there. Carl had a little bit of issue, picked up a cone halfway through the track. Slight advantage to Curtis on that first one. Now we're going to switch it up. Carl will lead. <laughs> Carl lost his ankle. All right, up next. Our next matchup is Andy versus Jake. Andy versus Jake as we see Carl spin out there. Nicely done. So it looks like Curtis will advance. So Andy and Jake, you guys are up next in the round of eight. Jamie and Matt are the next matchup. And then Dan and Abner. So guys, make your way to the start line, please. We're, we're losing daylight. Jake, yes, Jake is leading the first one. All right, Andy Pass. And Jake are on their way. All right, Jake with a good run here. Nice angle there, nice line. They both took pretty much the same line on that one. Uh, Jake did have a little bit better angle at the back end, stepping out a little bit more. And takes the wide angle again. And Jake is across the line, and here comes Andy multi-pass. All right, now they're going to switch it up. Andy will lead, Jake will follow. Jake a little bit more high speed on his run, so uh, he's going to have to wait for a little bit if he wants to uh, maintain his speed. All right. There you go, Andy takes off. Jake's, Jake gives him uh, quite a bit of a lead. Just so we can get his speed up. Start his drift early, both of them. New tricky section here. Nicely done by both of them. Good transition. Both take the wide line on that left-hander. Jake nails a cone, and Andy's got his turn signal on, just to let you know he's turning. Appreciate the heads up, Andy. It's a right turn. Got it. Jake. Jake will be advancing.